Hey everybody, it's Kent Jackson from Uniques and Antiques, and I'm going to do the walkthrough for our May 23rd, 2023 Decorative Arts Auction. About 600 lots featuring antique furniture, glassware, coins, perfumes, furniture, lots of great art, bronzes, clocks, lots of Franklin Mint art, Oriental carpets, mirrors, armoires, Lionel trains, tin toys. All right, this is about, we've had about the, the size of the walkthrough, so I'm going to go through uh, items at a time. You can see what we have. Lots of good coins here, baseballs. We start <clears throat> where the auction starts. Great collection of Lalique perfume bottles came in. Look at this great one right here, lot number one. And then we continue on, lot two is that grouping, lot all the way up to about lot 50 is these perfume bottles. Now, these are all like normal size perfume bottles, all Lalique, etc. But then we jump over to these. Look how big they are. So these are the store display factices, and you have the Fahrenheit and the Loris Azaro in the back there. You have Christian Dior. These are all huge, like six, 12, 16 inch bottles. Not full of perfume, full of kind of colored water. Venezia. Look at this great one back here. Look at the size of that. It's like as big as my hand. Uh, dab a little perfume on. Hopefully you don't drop it on your foot. All right, so about lot 50 ends the perfumes. And then we get into the items across the top here, which is some good artwork, some very good um, Franklin Mint, you have the leather-bound Franklin Library books, and it, accompanying them are original art from the Franklin Mint archives. So that's a very interesting little set right there. Some good famous authors, artists, did their, did their art in the books. Then we move on here. You have some carvings, stoneware, art pottery, some good Pappy Van Winkle. Service plates, Lennox, oyster plates. Let's continue on. This is a KPM plaque, lot 129. Nice size one there. There's a Cal Ripken Jr. jersey. That's lot number 131. And a painting of the Cincinnati Reg 1970s Big Red Machine. Coming this way, some good Asian pottery, which reminds me there's a lot of good Japanese and Chinese block prints a little bit later. So we're up to about lot 170 now. We have some good flatware. We have the herond animals. So once we continue on here, into the lot 200s is a great collection of costume jewelry in lots. Now I'm not going to look at each one of these tray lots on the video here, but suffice it to say that there are are great pictures, up to 20 pictures per lot of all the costume jewelry trays. Now these trays we sell down here by the whole tray. Some of these items right here, like that cameo is by itself. There's some nice gold earrings. Let's come around this way, more costume jewelry, some more Asian carvings across the top. We're up to about lot 200 now. Then we get into a little bit of uh, estate lot coins you have half dollars you have dollars you have quarters you know there's good uh you know a hundred hundred dollars in face here on some of them they're all broken down you have a little grouping of baseballs autographed you have proof sets coins then we get into a little bit more this is actually some from earlier of the franklin mint art, etc. 
coming over here. Once we get through the art, uh, the uh, coins, we have some good artwork on the walls here. Oil paintings. Very nice from a house we did near the uh, DuPont Country Club in Wilmington. Now this over here is all for our modern design auction coming up in June 6th. All of the items you see that are all carved up here, the artisan art. Nice Victrola. All right, so once we get through the, the large art, then we get do some smaller art, some great portraits, some good interior scenes. I believe if I come around this way, let me just walk a little bit further back because this is about lot the high 400s, but I think before the high 400s, we do these 300s, which is good bronzes, bronze, metal, nouveau, carvings. This is the mid 300s. And chandeliers, good classical ones. Little country. There's a very nice Biedermeyer bookshelf in the back there. These items are not very easy to see in the video here, but they are all described and pictured well on our catalog, on our website. This auction is for online bidding on live auctioneers, Invaluable and Bid Spirit, and also our website, uniquesandantiques.com. Once we, um, we come back here so we can look at some of the So in the lot 200s, kind of slightly out of order here, you have all of these Asian block prints. There's two levels. You have groupings here, all the way down. Japanese, Chinese block prints. Down here we have more. All right, while I'm back here, and before I go and do the furniture, we also have these, these, we end the auction with these groupings right here. So I'm gonna do like two, two levels at a time. You have books, you have sports memorabilia, silver plate lots, lots of great cameras. Look at this grouping of cameras right here. Look at this grouping of tin typewriters. Another grouping of tin typewriters, lot 598, 597 tin typewriters, all the way down. There's also a great grouping of Fisher Price pull toys and uh, Fisher Price Little People. You have books, dolls. Here's the Fisher Price pull toys. Look at that great little lot right there with the uh, the hen. Another grouping there. Pull toys. More pull toys. There's the um, circus wagon. More pull toys here. There's the uh, wooden cow. All right, let me get back here and we're gonna do the rest of the furniture. So here's a nice little grouping of chairs. These are by Baker. So there's a set of six of them. And they're the Baker, I think, uh, Charleston collection. Historic Charleston. This is like 417. So you have good little marble tops and brass candlesticks. There's a mission. There's a cello. There's a nice little cut steel glass top table. Look at that nice little shaker style. Shaker style rocker, or I guess it's just a chair. Some iron table, carved. Desks. Look at this nice grandfather clock. Very thick, deep one. This is a Goyard trunk. Signed in there as well. Goyard. Look at this great little corner cabinet in oak. Wall hanging one. It's a very nice inlaid table with drawers. Bedroom set. It's great 
end tables and carvings. There's a grouping of uh, kind of leather boundish books from the house executive documents. Here's a old time knuckle buster. And you have some good shotguns. Look at the mother of pearl on that stock right there. There's another one. These are all pictured better on our website, but this is my favorite. It has the, uh, looks like a boar kind of carved into it. You have that interesting trigger as well. More art. All right, then we come around the corner here. Nice little metal table. Some Asian porcelains. Portraits. Nice little Japan credenza. Already been down this aisle, but going down it again. Very nice lamps. Very nice porcelain. Pair of those guys. This is um, metal by Nestor. There's a banjo parts. There's an old time uh, meat scale, brass kind of incensors. This is a nice old piece right here. Look at that. The carvings. It opens up. Not really sure. It's got some age to it. Nice little kind of brass or cast iron umbrella. Bookcases, carpets. Just do one more look here. This is an amazing Ethan Allen kind of like cherry table, solid. Take a look when you get a chance at all of our Oriental carpets. These are high quality ones. Look at the uh, fineness of the of the weaving. And if you could see what they look like on the other side, they're super nice. Super nice. Come by and take a look. Preview for this auction is on Monday, the 22nd of May. And let me just back up here and I'm just going to take one. You know, let me go walk the other way because it will be confusing. I'd like to remind everybody our modern design auction is on June 6th. We're pretty much finished taking consignments for that auction. It's already going to be a three-day auction, June 6th, 7th, and 8th. All these items right here for the modern design auction, all the items back there, everything over here for the modern design. But this stuff down here, the drafting table is in the decorative sale, in the sale on the 23rd. Same thing with this little high chest, desk, this long credenza with a marble top. The uh, wicker chairs are all in the 23rd. This bedroom, dining room set by Cargis. All right, so that's about it. Let me just do one last pan of the place. Whoa, almost knocked over a chair. All right, so June 6th for the uh, deck for the uh, modern items over here. All these very cool kind of woodworkers things and artisan. Look at these chairs for June 6th. Wow. All right, coming over here just to finalize it. Perfumes, glassware, art, Asian, jewelry, coins, sports, art, furniture, art, Asian and uh, Japanese and Chinese block prints, more art, etc. All right, so this has been Kent Jackson from Uniques and Antiques. We'll see you at the auction. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.